Hi, passionate Rangers FC fans. Welcome to Rangers Update, your dedicated source for all things Rangers. Before we dive in, we want to express our gratitude for your unwavering support. If you bleed blue, don't forget to subscribe, smash that like button, and let's strengthen our community. Now, let's get into the latest updates, a hearty welcome to our new followers. Your backing means the world to us. WATP, let's get to the news. As Philippe Clement revealed that Rangers must offload players before making new signings this summer, a European club is poised to seize the opportunity and sign one of the top talents from Ibrox. This revelation has sparked speculation about potential departures and new arrivals, setting the stage for a dramatic transfer window. The summer transfer period has already seen several players bid farewell to Rangers. Recent departures include key figures like Ryan Jack, John McLaughlin, and Kimar Roof, all of whom left the club as free agents. Their exits are part of a broader trend of significant changes at Ibrox, with more departures likely on the horizon. Among those potentially on the move is James Taverney, the club captain whose future remains uncertain. Taverney has been frequently linked with transfers away from Rangers throughout the summer. A recent report suggested he might be following in the footsteps of his former teammates to Turkish club Trabzonspor. However, there's also speculation about a potential move to Saudi Arabia, where Steven Gerrard, the former Rangers manager, now manages Al Etifak. Taverney might be tempted by the prospect of reuniting with Gerrard and receiving a substantial pay raise. Amidst this uncertainty, one of Rangers' standout performers from last season has attracted interest from a European side. Cyril Dessers, who was a significant contributor for Rangers, is reportedly a target for Greek club pack. According to initial reports from the African media and relayed by Give Me Sport, Pack is keen to capitalize on Rangers' current financial situation and may soon make an offer for Dessers. Pack is considering a loan to buy arrangement for Dessers, proposing an initial loan with an option to purchase for £3 million. Given that Dessers was acquired by Rangers for £4 million from Cremonese last summer, Rangers' head of recruitment, Nils Koppen, will likely aim to secure a higher fee. The report highlights that Pack has been enchanted by Dessers' to exceptional goal scoring prowess. With Dessers having netted 22 goals across all competitions last season, Rangers will be keen to recoup their initial investment. While Dessers is open to leaving if the right offer comes in, the pressure is on Coppen to negotiate a deal that reflects the striker's value. Before we continue, make sure to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications to get all the exclusive news about Rangers FC. Don't overlook any details about your beloved team. It's crucial for Rangers FC fans. In a recent whirlwind of controversy, Stephen Nismith has ignited a firestorm of debate with his provocative remarks about Rangers. The former Rangers star and current heart of Midlothian head coach took a surprising swipe at his old club, suggesting that Rangers, despite their storied history, lack the potential to compete at the highest levels. Nismith's comments have sent shockwaves through Scottish football, challenging the conventional narrative surrounding one of the most successful clubs in the league. Nismith's critical view of Rangers comes as a jarring departure from the often held belief that the club's financial clout and fanbase should translate into perennial dominance. In his remarks, Nismith downplayed the club's prospects, questioning their ability to sustain a competitive edge in European competitions and casting doubt on their long term ambitions. His comments have not only ruffled feathers but have also sparked a wider debate about the current state and future of Rangers. As a former player who once wore the Rangers jersey with pride, Nismith's criticisms are particularly poignant. Having enjoyed a successful stint at the club between 2007 and 2012, including winning multiple league titles, his sudden shift in perspective is both surprising and intriguing. Fans and analysts alike are grappling with this stark contrast between Nismith's past loyalty and his present skepticism. The timing of Nismith's remarks could not be more critical. With Rangers enduring a challenging season and struggling to assert themselves on the European stage, his comments add fuel to the already heated discussion about the club's strategic direction and managerial decisions. As Rangers attempt to navigate these turbulent waters, Nismith's observations serve as a stark reminder of the mounting pressures facing the club. As Stephen Nismith's comments continue to stir controversy, the focus now shifts to the Rangers fan base. 
How do the supporters of the Light Blues perceive this unexpected critique from a former player who once celebrated success with the club? The reaction from the stands has been mixed, with some fans feeling betrayed by Nysmith's words, while others argue that his honesty may be a necessary wake-up call for the club. Many loyal Rangers supporters are grappling with the shock of hearing such disparaging remarks from someone who was once a hero in their ranks. For those who remember Nysmith's time at Ibrox fondly, his criticisms feel like a personal affront. They question whether his comments are an attack on the club's current efforts or a reflection of deeper frustrations within Scottish football. Conversely, there is a faction of fans who view Nysmith's comments as a catalyst for positive change. They argue that acknowledging the club's shortcomings, especially from a figure with insider knowledge, could prompt a re-evaluation of strategies and inspire improvements. For these supporters, Nysmith's harsh critique could be seen as an opportunity to address issues that might otherwise go unspoken. The broader question remains, will this controversy lead to a constructive dialogue about the future of Rangers, or will it deepen existing divides? As the fanbase processes Nysmith's remarks, their collective response could significantly impact the club's approach to rebuilding and reassessing its ambitions. Only time will tell how this situation will influence Rangers' path forward and whether it will unite or further fragment the passionate supporters of this iconic club. In the wake of this controversy, Rangers must now confront the implications of Nysmith's critique. Will this serve as a catalyst for introspection and reform, or will it further divide the club's supporters and management? As the debate unfolds, one thing is clear, Stephen Nysmith's bold statements have injected a new layer of drama into Scottish football, ensuring that all eyes will be on Rangers as they seek to prove their doubters wrong. Greetings, fans! Make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel, as it's greatly appreciated by Rangers FC. And don't forget to share your thoughts on the news in the comments section below. Until the next video, stay tuned!